I think we can start now. Yeah, I agree. Yes, madam. Okay, so my name is Neetu. So no one has to call me madam or ma'am. <laughs> It might be possible okay. that I have, I am similar to you as well. So let me start with my quick introduction, and then we we can begin with yours. Okay. So you know I started the learning C, uh, SAP Pico as for Hana uh, in the month of uh, I think April two thousand twenty two only. It was for two months, and uh, the classes were online. The training part was good. But we have not got any real time experience there. So they have taught us the theory part, the configuration only. No real time projects were there during the training session. Any one of you are working here, or any prior experience? No, Nitu. No, man. Okay. And okay. I am working as a end user, but uh, in GL process. Okay, so you have a GL account. But, that that is good actually. Uh, yeah, but that is a different uh, tool, ERP tool. We are not using SAP. Okay, so you, so anyone yeah. is trained here in SAP? Has anyone of you uh, took any course? Madam, my name is Sadish. I have recently completed my post graduation M M com, madam. Present uh, I have go to present I have staying in Hyderabad. Present I have go to coaching in S A P S A P F A C O, madam. So it is going on or have you completed it? No, madam. Present going on. Last ten days ago, back okay. I have joined course. Okay. It's going on, right? So how is it going? Present S N business area to consultation business area. Some parts. Okay, so you have you have just started accounts. only. Okay, it's the basic yes, part. Yes, madam. Yes, madam. So, are they providing any kind of placement after uh, after the completion of course, or any no, real time madam, projects? No, madam. No placement. No. Yeah. No, madam. No real time projects. Okay. Uh, anyone else would like to share anything about their prior experience or something? Yeah, good evening, ma'am. This is uh, for me. I'm Hello. from Hyderabad. Okay. Yeah, ma'am. Good evening, ma'am. This is for me from Hyderabad, ma'am. Hi, Swami. I recently completed my FICO course and uh, with a real-time uh, scenario. Oh, that's nice. Hello. Yeah, I can hear you. That is nice. Actually, you have worked on real-time scenarios during your training phase. Yeah, real, uh, real training phase. Okay, so have you got any placement yet? No, ma'am. Okay, so you're you're trying. Yeah. Okay. Uh, how much course duration? You know, it depends. Uh, the yeah. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Please Sorry. continue. Duration course be uh, is two months uh, real time course, and uh, Pico course is uh, a. Uh, eight months of course. Eight months. Yeah, ma'am. Satya Narayan Sir in Amit Pet area. Okay, so they must have taught really well because it's eight months. It's a long duration. Yeah, eight months training plus two months real time scenarios. They are given practice. Am I right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, nice. That's nice, actually. So, Swami, is it possible that you can share with us some real time scenarios as well? It might help to other sure. and me also. Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. So now yeah. tell me how we should start practicing SAP. If we we all are a fresher, we are uh, looking for consultant profile, and some of us are working as an end user, right? Yeah. Okay. So how? But real time is. In course, uh, different, uh, very different, and uh, real time scenarios very different. We Correct. are seeing and the course is very, very, very different, and uh, we are working on uh, real time scenarios is very different. Work on and out code is different. Skin is different now. Okay. But we are uh, trying to practice uh, uh, topic by topic in the class. Uh, right. That is not uh, important. 
right but right real time is very very important yes sir nice so it would be it would be great swami if you could share some those real time scenarios right so they must be yeah, like you mind. you have to show the uh, as per my understanding in real time yeah. like the client will tell you that we need to show the reporting segment wise so there you have to apply the document splitting i think correct me if i am wrong yeah certainly when next process code is done uh, sorry uh, somebody is saying something we can't hear you okay rohit is rohit is saying saying we should start with the accounts payable part but somebody kiran was saying that we should start with the basic company configuration yes need to as per this call as a no better to go with the configuration part first okay actually let me let me clear you there is no agenda for this call it was a random call rohit just said i think we should do a zoom meeting so i thought okay we might um, might even get prepared for the next next week so let me just show you my screen okay let's see how it goes what we can start you please share your inputs whatever you have uh is my screen visible to everyone uh hello visible it's visible nahi to okay. yeah ma'am yeah thank thank you thank you so this is 1909 product no sir for where we are supposed to get s4 hana 1909 all items are as per So for end user, I know you guys are already aware about this part. For end user, only codes are available to us. To us, uh, where we can access it. So like uh, I can access the FK zero one. I've just started their accounts payable. So we have only few few, few codes there that we can access. Let's begin with. This is the main screen for configuration part. So you just type SPR or go to this SAP reference IMG. and then enterprise structure sadhana definition okay financial accounting define company so this is the screen where we start first of all by creating the company uh, i hope you are clear with the company and company code part yeah yes okay new entry so company is the group uh, like the tata we have and under subsidiaries these are uh, counted as company codes so we we can pick any example mm -hmm. Where is the is this company name or company code name this is company okay company is different company code is different company is like the uh, the main entity under which we have different subsidiaries the subsidiaries are called as company code the live example we have uh, reliance group so we have uh, many uh, reliance corporation uh, and uh, can you name any subsidiaries of reliance uh, reliance group. like you can go red smart points reliance and uh, red geo reliance pharmacy yes. Yes, yes. Reliance yes. Petroleum. Right, right. Yes. So these are the company Sorry. codes. Right. Sorry, Ritu. Sorry to interrupt. That is not for the company code. That is for subsidiary companies. Company is the organization unit, I think. Yeah. Okay. Reliance is a company. In that Reliance Smart, Reliance Geo, these are the subsidiary companies. Subsidiary companies. Correct. Okay. Exactly. Okay, proceed, Nitu. So these are the basic details about company and the currency of company. 
The company is created. Now we have to create the company code. Guys, do you know how we can uh, see the key codes for it? No, as you, you are incorrect, but click on the definition. The display box is there. Click on the arrow mark to show the key codes. Which one? Uh, come for the enterprise structure. The same thing on the IMG activity. Click on that. I'm sorry, come again. Just additional information. Okay. Additional information again. Yes. Yeah, display key. Yes. The IMG activity. That's what I did. On that. it yeah, yes. Yeah. Come, come to the enterprise structure. Just click on the drop down. Just click on that. Okay, 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 yeah. okay, okay. Got it, got it. Thank you, thank you so much. Yeah. Okay. So this is a T code um, OX15 for comp uh, creating company. And OX02, I think it is for company code creation. Uh, is it better to go through key codes or uh, fast in real time? Or for uh, that that's depends upon you. That's depends upon you. It's uh, capable of if you can remember the key codes, you can go with the key codes. You are capable with the path, you can go with the path. But it has, everything is to you, up to you. But, uh, okay, thank you. But interview point of uh, what we see, see, what see, see that interview point of view, what happened? You know, somebody will ask some particular T code. See, for example, nobody will ask a T code. See, you can go with that SAP, FICO, a lot of T codes around 30,000 T codes. You can't have in a man, you can't be able to remember the T codes, right? Nobody's know anything. T codes, see, sir. see, you can different, different T codes. Is there OX15, OX13, like OX05? Like OBB07, like something, some different, different T codes. Is it that T codes you can't be able to remember? So, that time, what we tend to do, what particular, you know, the, uh, that, that, that thing where you can use and where you can remember that. These are things where, where can you are training and you can practicing a lot of time, you can practice, 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 practice. That is that only can remember it. Apart of that, you cannot practice anything, we didn't get anything SAP. That is for sure. Okay, uh, Kashi, thank you. To go like this, like explaining these all these topics, because I think you will found this on the YouTube as well. What we can do is we can pick one topic because I don't think this way we can go very long. We can pick uh, one topic so, and yes, we. Yes, so you can ask that people if they have any doubts or anything. Yes, that's... yes, because this. That's also you can learn for... something. Yes, 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 yes. Right, exactly, because you will found. Many people even explaining good. They will explain very good than me. You will find this on YouTube, and I can I, I can uh, recommend one. There is one. Uh, please go and search for Himanshu Agrawal. He explains really well on YouTube. You will found found from basic to advanced level about this SAP FICO. He has explained every topic and very clearly and precisely. So I think that would be great. Here we can what we can discuss about the interviews. And any specific topic for configuration part, what we can do, we can practice here. That is my suggestion, yeah. actually. Because yeah, we, we all yeah, know. Yeah. Because, uh, different persons will give different solutions. So yes. it will use people. Yes, that would be great, actually, for everyone. Because I am not much experienced. So <laughs> who am I to expert? teach you actually i i here i i just share my experience with you so that it, it might help you in any way i am also learning i am also looking for consultant provide <laughs> yeah understand yeah so here we can discuss all these things like 
So somebody was asking about how to do the document splitting part. I think so we can cover that. We we all can go through the uh, like practice and we can just put our questions and error if we are getting any. Like uh, I I am getting one error. I have uh, to help from Koshik. So I think he will provide me some solution in future. So Kiran, uh, you are working in GL, right? Yes, but uh, the tool is not SAP. Yeah, that's not SAP. That is ERP. And uh, Koshik has got one rollout project, and he has earlier worked on implementation and support project as well. So that is really good, actually. Congratulations again, Koshik. Uh, not a problem. Thank you for that. What else? If you are facing any issues or anything, please post here. We will help on it. If you we know, otherwise can't. Yes. We know we can surely will help on it because SAP is a version, not a C or anything. And you know, it's up to the client. If we are, when we are working, so it is up to the client how how they want us to work. What what uh, version? Yes. So currently, my version that is not is... the remote desktop. It is the cloud. S four Hana cloud. Uh, don't feel in our all people are new fresh and we are all learning stage yes yes don't feel right, right. we don't know english we don't know hindi we don't know telugu or etc etc that is not a problem we are also the starting stage please speak with any language or any form not a problem if anybody is there they will be translate that is good for that we can yeah, we, we have many people from south so they yes, can yes. translate that in, <laughs> into english and i know hindi so i can translate that with hindi <laughs> So I'm good with Hindi and English. Does see all people are same thing only you know a lot of people are suffering from the communication. Yes. Even me too was not perfect in English. Hello. Yes. 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 Yeah. Uh, you explain me what is the uh, depreciation area. You are getting the any error in the depreciation area, or else like you want to the total depreciation area explanation. Uh, you want to know any? You are getting any error while doing the practice or real time? Yeah, I see all the videos of Man Su Agarwal. Okay. okay, is that you, Rohit? Yeah. Okay, so I think he has explained quite well. Yeah, yes, you are right. Kashik, you can tell us what is the most important uh, sub module in the FICO if we have to start with one. uh in that is see in implementation project we can do they will be assigned some particular sub module like the basic settings one consultant like ap for one and uh, ar for one like they will be assigned to us otherwise they will be like team as well it like around like two all people so that in process there they will be the different different teams like abap and the basic team also will come And along with that, they will FIT team and the MM consultants. Along with that, mingle the all of people who can do it. Why? Because we don't know the what is the exactly happened. MM and SD also we can get it right. Like invoice, POS and S four also will get it. So, no, I I meant the sub modules. See, under under FICO we have like uh, asset accounting, accounts receivable, payable. Yes, yes, yes. So yes. let's say, let's say. Uh, i am very much good in accounts receivable right but i know the basic idea about the complete fico part cost center cost element everything asset accounting depreciation area and everything rest of the part i know the basic idea but i i have a very good hand on ar and ap so uh, do you think we need to have a good hand on every module sorry hello to become a consultant i uh, am sorry please give me a minute okay friends Hello. you know about uh, direct oh. indirect tax uh that you know one thing what happened you know direct direct and indirect taxes just you can learn the basic things whenever you want that the company will be provide for kt for that why because of different different countries different different taxes is there yeah but uh, what is the process of invoice and mm. uh, 
Hello. Yes, yes, Roy. Yeah, I'm saying uh, what is the invoice and uh, document post process? Okay, okay. You are asking about that AR AP like transactions. So how you are posting like that, or else uh, we can yeah, know yeah, the. Yeah. Yeah, right. like yeah, yeah, like we are create a vendor with tax. Uh, I think code is left as forty three. Mm hmm. Yes, yes, yeah, yes. But, uh, yeah. Then after uh, after the uh, next step, what is the next step? See the see whatever configuration. See we can create the vendor master card. Like for example, you can take some ex company where uh, vendor from vendor is came to our us. So we are creating the vendor master data. So vendor master data, what you can do? Like vendor details, everything you can configure the SPR screen, right? Okay. Right. In a okay. SPR screen, what happened? You can configure the all the details. So like what are the details that you from the from the vendor? You will get the file yeah. like any data VMD. We call it as a VMD. VMD in the sense, uh, vendor master data. So we'll get the yeah. and in that everything will be the full field like the company name, who are the responsible person, bank account details, address. And what is the requirement? Everything they will be filled, and everything you can configure that in the SPR screen. After that, you can yeah. test the whatever the TR code it will become right. We we'll get the TR okay. code. No TR code. Uh, hello. Which? Hello. TR. TR. TR code for uh, vendor with tax. No, no. I'm telling about that. You know TR. TR. Ah, TR. Transport request. No, no, no. See in see in tier where we get in the sense once in one while configuring it after saving that we we'll get the one number like just now uh need to created one tier like this creation xm uh if you don't mind need to please share the screen there will be help on it. Sure, sure. So I have to show them that tier request, right? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so let's say I'm creating one company code here. Okay. Now it will create when I will save it, so it will it will generate one request. So it's a unique, right? Okay. Uh, creating a company. Okay, fine, fine. You can create it. You can give the country a reason. Um, Maharashtra. What is it? This you didn't give anything, not a problem. This one? Yeah. This is called the uh, S4 HK90680, right? <laughs> that is the TRE. Okay. If you want me, so we can create the own TR request also here. One request, like uh, one request means uh, already pre previously created some TRs. Right. This is the uh volt yes in a sense so we created a lot of uh, things like axm hcl data and the one like that we can create that and in company what happened you know uh, they will assign that lot of company codes so we, each and every company can put in different different uh, trs but because of whenever we want the reports it will come automatically if you are posting that one tr on different different post uh, different different trs it will be diff difficult to find out so we'll get that is the TS. If you want me to see here, I uh, can uh, description. You need to change anything means just click on the create. It will have some details like short description, long description, and everything. Uh, just click on the yeah. See here. Here are the short description and just uh, give that. And uh, here task you just it will automatically capture the your username who is the creator. And after that, just click on the save. It automatically it's shown. That is the TR code. Okay. I hope it's clear. TR. Yeah. Yes, bro. Yes, bro. And okay. Fine. Fine. So 
and to add on to this point these tr are generated only on the spro screen not for the end yes, user yes. right end user screen yes yes, yes. Okay. so i was asking a question so can you answer it now yeah uh, what was it like do we have to become a pro for consultant in every module or we can just have a good hand on uh, any one module and we we can have like basic idea we know how 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 to create the depreciation area and all the all those configuration but we are not very uh, good at it like we know every error and we can sort it so i know about accounts receivable accounts payable part so do you think we have any good chance for consultant profile for if we have that kind of knowledge uh basic knowledge is very important it is because of we don't know which project will get which client will get it, we don't know on first thing and second thing what do you know uh, they will be agent which part like al al ap sorry uh, aa ap ar we don't know which project they will be agent also so based on the requirement based on the client requirement they we will be work on it and nothing to worry on one more thing we have they will be share the kt sessions they will mm -hmm. be give the uh kt like in kt sessions they will be know oh he is well on ap he is well on ir like that right knowledge transfer and, and yes yes the kt means knowledge transfer and most of the people are working on that ir ap gr no few very rare people are working on the asset accounting because of asset accounting is very difficult to do that is a prank thing right i agree <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so people are working so in this. what they actually expect from a fresher they are completely fresh or they have not worked any on real time scenarios they know the configuration but they have not worked actually right and you just said that theory theoretically different and when you will work on real time so scenarios would be totally different what yes, they actually, exactly. what they expect from a fresher in a fresher what they expect uh, they are capable or not they will be handle see for example we have some different different steps is they like in accounting ar what happen you know we can do the configurations bank on uh, bank house banking configurations and we can do the app like how we can do the configuration they will ask us some steps like you can how you can do the app uh, app configuration steps like you can just tell that uh, you can do that by using of the fdjp you can seven steps is there payment country like that they will be just you can explain it briefly okay. rather than they if you are uh, if you are giving any uh, missing or anything that is not at all problem for us. they will be understand okay they are the freshers uh, there will be no uh, steps and what you can do it they, and uh, one more thing they won't go for the depth. like so you, if you clicking on the payment of country what will they ask that not not like just they will be ask the steps and uh, what is that accounting cycle like a uh, ap process cycle ar cycle right and uh, and what is that migo uh, migo t codes uh, migo entry like that they will be asked just a basic questions not for that uh, total oh, depth okay. uh, de depends upon the what, see one more thing what you know uh, what you mentioned that resume before that be prepared for that what you mentioned that resume each every word that is the main thing if you are no for that asset accounting you can mention that if you are don't know asset accounting just mention as you can mention just knowledge of asset accounting like that Okay, okay, I've got my answer. Actually, thank you so much, Kashi. You know, I really feel now much more confident. <laughs> no, no. Actually, I face a lot. Uh, you know, Anitul. Okay, I get it. In North, actually, there are. I think, as compared to South, they have more opportunities for SAP people, right? As compared to North, not like hey, that. Hey, if you yeah. have the knowledge and everything, you will get it anywhere. Not for yeah, South. That North, that East. is of course right. You if you have a good knowledge, then you can get everything. but like demand is more there in in here in delhi they they need more experienced one in hcl as well i have checked the inner reference for uh, so they are like asking for 3 uh, 3 to 3.5 years of experience in hcl and uh, they have they, frank, they, yeah yes yes continue 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 okay and they need prior experience on implementation project so they have specifically mentioned those things for hcl and one more thing in market we know what happened you know in sap consultant as a fresher we can't very mm -hmm. difficult right and if you want yeah if you want that sap finco finco consultant you can do just any small companies like some of the some small companies is there they will get uh, some small projects where you can work 
After that, we'll get some experience, we'll get experience. After that, you can move further. 